Alright, I think I'm going to make another video now that we're about to play uh, a Champions League group match against Villarreal. Um, since last time uh, we won our game against Sassolo, um, that was a really key win. Uh, they were in third place when we beat them and it moved us up to second. And then we subsequently lost to 20th place Crotone, um, which was just really brutal. Um, that was very frustrating. It knocked us down to fourth place. Like, I think that was that was Crotone's first victory of the year. So, awesome. I don't know what's wrong with the team. Um, I, I did play a few players that were not quite as great, but I, I mean, it was a pretty good team. Um, I'm going to go ahead and load up the best team I can, I can put together here, I suppose. Um... I need to give a rest to Hysage. Poor dude has played an absolute ton this season. Um, and he's getting pretty tired, I was told. Um, make sure I like the rest of my team. Yeah, I think I got some pretty decent looking Pretty decent looking subs there, so we'll go ahead and submit that team. We're coming out with a, we're gonna come out with our our control outlook and uh, see if we can't, you know, at least get a draw. I think a draw, depending on what Moscow does, we'll have to see what they manage. A win would put us through for sure. Um, we do have a game away against Astania. But a draw here, and I think a draw against Estonia would put us through as well. That would get us to 11 points, which I think would be enough to put us ahead of with Villarreal and Moscow having to pit play their last game against each other. Let's go ahead and apply the advice to our team. Um... Come on, guys, go go out there and, and and do the damn thing here. Let's go ahead and go to extended highlights. See what we can get going. All right, uh, let's not get caught in possession. <laughs> in our own box. Okay, there we go. Got a highlight starting with them coming off of a free kick. Um, they get a shot on target. First shot on target of the game goes to Villarreal. They've got the possession advantage so far too, but it's still early. Let's see what Insigne can do. Nothing. Homfist <laughs> works it into Gabbiadini who takes a nice shot, so we got a shot off as well. Insigne whips it in. Nothing doing though. Looks like we won the throw in. And we'll skip ahead here. Ugh. <coughs> Looks like our Mesovich guy made a mistake there and almost let a, a cross, a dangerous cross get in and could have scored a goal. Um, Kyle was tackled in the box there. Uh, looking for a penalty, maybe. It's hard to tell in 2D mode, though. We've just really struggled of late in, in the last few games. It's like, uh, I think the last game, I outshot them th like 30 to 3, and I lost 1 0. We just could not score to save our lives. Hit the post a bunch of times. Uh, Milkman was the striker. Um, he only had 25% of his shots on target, and he had 10 shots. Oh, or 11 shots, or something like that. Looks like they're doing a little better than us right now. I 
thought that was a penalty for a second there. We're 27 minutes in and we are not doing our, our normal job of holding possession here. Um, let's, let's check our instructions. We've got it set to work the ball into the box, which I like. Um, Have the team be a little more disciplined. Calhoun picks up the ball, slides it forward. Uh, Mekovic overlaps, and uh, he's not going to really do good crossing the ball. Um, it's unfortunate that I lost my good sub for the right back position when Maggio went down for the season with a broken leg. Maggio was playing really well too for a sub. I think he. Actually, I had the highest match rating of anybody on my team. He only played in about five games, but um, well, they've got some pretty ball movement there. Didn't really come to anything yet, but they are moving it around well. Another shot on target for them. Kambu's just a nice player. He really pulls my defense out of shape when we're trying to stop him. Uh-oh. Free kick here. That was about like how everything's been going lately. My defense just kind of sits there and we slowly let them move the ball forward without really doing anything. Um, Kambu has plenty of time. It takes several touches and uh, does not get closed down. So let's see if we can be a little more aggressive in our pressing maybe. They might get us a little more pulled out of shape now with that, but hopefully we won't let them just walk towards our goal in the future. It'd be nice if Calajon wouldn't try to take on two defenders at once. Yeah, they're just moving the ball around us again. Fortunately, we closed him down a little earlier, so he had to shoot from the top of the box there, but he actually had kind of an open player, so that's a little worrying. That There you go. Nice interception, Insigne. Allen moving the ball forward. Nice pass to Calion. He works it in to Insigne. It would have been nice if Insigne would have worked that in a little closer to take a better shot, but um, at this point, I'll take what I can get. Looks like we got an injury for them here. I don't know why we gotta watch all this, but here we are. Expect a much better job from the second half here, boys. Um, all right, let's just see what they can do.
We better get a goal back here quick if we even want to draw. There you go, Calion crosses it in. Um, looks like he made the goalie tip it over. Got a corner kick here. Let's see if Homfist can put it in on target. Albio picks it up and is robbed um, and loses possession. This is a team I beat 3 0 on the road um, in a pretty even game, but uh, still, that was back when my finishing was working and my defense was playing well together. And now I just got really lucky, Bakam, we couldn't finish that. We got completely pulled out of shape, probably because I had that higher closing down, and they just threaded the ball through on me. We're going to have to go to attacking now, I think. Um, up the tempo a little bit. See if we can get a substitution on here. Couple subs. See what we can do, boys. Nothing. We can do nothing. Looks like another loss here. Gabbiadini does nothing with it. Definitely going to be another loss. Go into overload mode. Guess the good news is um, I've still got a good goal difference with my losses coming by one goal each. Um, wins coming by three goals, three goals and one goal. If it comes down to goal difference, I should have an advantage, I would think. That'll do it. We're not going to win the ball back here. Come on. Get, close down faster. There you go. Now get it moving. What in the hell was he doing? <sighs> Jorginho kicks it out of play with 20 seconds left. No, they're just going to time waste. Yep. Another loss. Just been a disastrous run of form. Everybody's in a poor mood. Everyone's downtrodden. Now we're down to second place in the league. Um, and it's going to come down to the last match. Uh, fortunately for us, Moscow and Villarreal have to play each other. So a draw there with me winning at Estonia, um, at Estonia, would put me through. Um, we're still leading in goal difference, and, and we should be able to maintain that. But um, all we needed to do was win one in our last three, and we've now lost two straight um, in group play. Like I said, as you can see, our recent fixtures have just been a shit show. Um, loss. So we've lost four of our last five games after really only losing one of our first like 20 games total we've lost four of our last five so see what mr manager can do to put things back together here